Hi guys, welcome back. I thought we'd have a look at a Marvel Superheroes Avengers Infinity Wars Thor's Weapon Quest and Thamos's Ultimate Battle, two of the four sets that came out for the new Infinity War. Uh, and I'm liking them. I didn't like them when I first saw them because I thought eh, that ship looks kind of, um, I don't know, Prius of the Milanos, if you want to go there. But I've fallen in love with it. He's cool. Um, uh, we are dating. That's how much I like it. But I always like the Milano so much better. Um, let's have a look at the minifigures. Uh, well, it's a good place to start. This kick ass Iron Man with his m Japanese anime style inspired back jets and his pulses coming out of his hand. He actually looks badass. And if you go through his visor, which I can't with one hand, he's got like all blue over his face on one side of it to, you know, show all his tech and stuff that he's using. So he's cool. I'm going to put him over there. Um, let's, we've got Rocket Raccoon. Uh, funny story, I put his tail upside down and then I complained, why the hell is his tail in the way of him st um, standing? Yes, that's what we're working with, um, boys and girls. Uh, we've got Teenage Rocket, uh, Teenage, uh, Teenage Groot, which is cool. He's got like um, the thorny plant thing. Um, I thought they'd give you two of those, but they only gave you one, which is kind of cheap Lego. Uh, Gamora, which came with a bunch of swords. Uh, of course, another Star Lord because um, I don't have enough Star Lords, but this one comes without his helmet, so another Star Lord. Um, we've got Thor here. He's got two heads, one's with all electricity, which I think is that one, and one without. And he's got his new hammer um, and those like flicky, well, the ones that show he's got power in his hands. That's cool. Um, that doesn't go on the end of rockets. Um, gun, but they always give you spare pieces, and the spare pieces you can go nothing with. Oh, look, I got a spare stud of um, blue see through color. So, yes, you also get this in the um, Thor. This is, I guess, makes the weapon. It's a little hodgepodge, um, but it you know, does its job, I guess. And if they left this out, it wouldn't have worried me. Um, you get the Chaos Gem, you actually got four Chaos Gems, so that's pretty cool. I think that's, um, no, it's not Soul, could be Mine, Mind, yeah, I think it's Mine. But, yeah, that's pretty cool, and it, yeah, I like the spinny bit and the electricity and all that. Again, if they left it out, I wouldn't even even noticed, so it's not a big thing. Now, the main event is Thamus, yeah. Um, I don't, I don't know... How I feel about these big ass Lego figures. I've got Dark Seed like this too, and he kind of stands up, but he's a little top heavy. I mean, if you put his sword down, okay, he's not proving my point. Um, but you get the Infinity Gauntlet and a hand, so you can swap them out. And his sword, which I totally remember in the movie. So the problem with this is if I want to show the face, I have to literally pick him up and like get him to stare because this arch back is not good for your back, Thamus. In in the future, you're going to have back problems. Trust me. But you know, he's cool. I guess he's angrier than he was in the movie. Um, thought they would have done something a bit more of his chin. But there you go. We'll put him over there. So much, you know, so much you can do in Lego. And a huge purple chin is not one of them, I guess. Now the the Milano Part Two, as I'm going to call it because I, I was too lazy to look up the actual name of it. You can tell me I'm an idiot and give me the correct name in the comments. It is actually really nice. I wasn't sold on it when I first saw it on the box, but as I've seen it in real life and I've seen a few pictures on the internet before I bought the set, I kind of fell in love with it. And it's nice. It's, it's, the, the, it's good to see something on grey that it isn't grey on grey or black on grey or green on grey and the orange on grey really stands out makes it very, look very unique mm. and and the design is nice it looks like the Manalo but they've done they've kind of made it a little well it's kind of smaller I guess or simpler but it still looks pretty cool and it's got this like back bit where it's got Thamus's original hand on that there you can put the uh, Chaos or the Infinity Gauntlet on there if you want. Why do I keep calling it Chaos? Um, and this opens up and has a little like freaking old person 
um, buggy thing that comes out that has all of um, Gamora's um, swords on it. Of course, we've got extra swords. Extra swords. Lots of extra swords, but no extra freaking weed thing for a teenage group. It is a... I like it. It's nice. The wings are really nice. It was a really um, fun build. And now I just have to find a room for all this. Oh, well. Have fun. Bye.